Just took to the street Sunday protesting the murder of four young men in Kitangela on the 8th of August. The motorcycle riders accompanied by the deceased family members paralyzed operations on Mombasa Road towards Kitangela demanding the criminals involved be brought to book. These are the scenes that characterized Mombasa Road as hundreds of motorcycle riders paralyzed operations during a protest on the way to Kitangela police station. Here, they blocked the entrance as they demanded audience with the station's bosses on the progress in nabbing those who killed four of their colleagues last week. Hakuna kitu wanafanya, hakuna mtu wa mearrest, tumenda ground na omara nene so far, hakuna kitu mefanyika. The motorcycle riders were accompanied by family members of the four slain young men. There's nothing he wouldn't do for people he loved. He went over and above. He made sure he nurtured all our talent. He pushed us to be the best people we could be. And the worst thing is like being on this road, doing even drink so much memory. You know what I can say about him? He was not violent. He was so calm. The four include two brothers, Victor Mwangi Wanjiru, 25 years old, and his brother Frederick Moraithi Wanjiru, who was 30 years old, as well as their two other friends, Mike George Onduso, who was 29 years old, and Nicholas Echengo Musa, who was 28 years old. They were reportedly murdered by villages and their bodies badly mutilated, dumped near Munjiriri River in the evening of August the 8th. A senior DCI boss says investigations have zeroed in on two main suspects who are currently on the run. The riders and young men donned in dreadlocks have also condemned the profiling of persons with dreadlocks. Family is very sick. I'm going to go to the house and I'm going to go to the house. Uh, ku, ku arrested na tukasema ya kwamba tunaheshimu sheria sisi uh, private bikers sio kila mtu anaendesha pikipiki ambaye ni, ni mwizi ambaye anafanya ukora the private riders association chairman Sami Kiumbe says their members will be holding peaceful demonstrations until justice is served for sunday express i'm Serafina 